All this when we talk about things, you know, it's just in my mind. Hi, welcome to TOL. Thinking out loud is where we talk about issues in our heads. Like, you know, just, you just you're driving and you're thinking about it and you're, and you're actually thinking and thinking about it. So it's an opportunity to vent out. Of course, for all of you who have suggested topics that you've thought about and giving your reasons, one of such is what we're going to be talking about today. The issue of no change. Okay, I'm going to give you a background story and this is something that's no, no, no psych. So this actually happened to me. I've, I've been a victim of no change from eateries. You know, you buy something in a mall. Once it's like 50, 50 naira, hundred naira. Ah, uh, haba. No change. Nobody even talks about it. They don't even tell you. So this day, I went to a bank, a bank. I'm like not joking, a bank. So I have a, I have a check, cash. Now I'm not very, I'm not very big or not. You know when you have like a bulk money and then there's some like maybe some money outside the dots. You know those ones. I don't really like take notes. So if it's like a hundred thousand, maybe it's a hundred thousand fifty-seven naira. In my mind, it's a hundred thousand. I do know that there's something after it, but I just know I'm going to get a hundred thousand. So I went to this bank early in the morning. It was like early. It was like nine or nine thirty. So I gave them the check. So even though I knew there was, some, uh, there was something after it, I, I didn't know how much, but I knew there was something afterwards. So the guy counted the money, you know, and he gave me. So I had taken it. He counted it with that, they are counting thingy. Okay, so I know how much it is. And I, I started going and I thought to myself, ah, no. There was some money after the dots, you know, the cobalt side or whatever. There was like maybe another 121 naira or something. So I didn't see any 120, I'm not talking about the 1 Naira or the 21 Naira. It just ended in the 1,000 Naira notes. So I said, oh, am I, was I wrong? So I just turned back and said, sorry, um, the check, can I just see the check again? He said, uh, what? I said, oh, I think I have something after the 200,000. He said, oh, oh yes, no change. I didn't understand. I said, sorry, I said, I repeated myself, I said, in the check, just check. He said, yes, he doesn't have change. Ah. <laughs> I said, a bank. He now said, yes, there's no change. Next, uh, oh my days. Oh, you know, you know you're not taking me there. You just know that you, you ah, come on. You can't, to a Bini girl, hello, next. <laughs> I said, next to where? You didn't pay me my money complete. My check says 150, 200,000, something naira. You gave me 200,000. He said, excuse me. Excuse me, I just explained to you. And this is how it was doing. Even giving me attitude on oh, my own check. I just explained to you, there's no change. He was still repeating this at 9.30 a.m. in the morning. Oh, I had enough energy for him. So I said, I'm going to stand here until you get... How can a bank that has a vault behind tell me... Just, oh, it's in place to tell me there's no change. I go to the shopping mall, they tell me there's no change. I buy something from the person hawking on the road. There's no change. They're a bank. Who gives you money? Says there's no change. When I give them money, when I feel, feel that deposit for my, maybe I write 157 naira, 100,000, 7 naira, give me 100,000, but I don't have change, just feel it. When they take it from me, so the guy was like, eh, I'm, I'm stalling the line. Oh, I like Nigerians. When, when it's time, you know, to be corporate, Nigerians can be. The woman behind me said, oh no, she's not stalling the line at all. It's about, for this brand, I'm tired of you, it's about time. And everybody on the line behind me said that they are okay, that the guy should go inside and go and look for change. And this young man felt this was the day to teach me a lesson. He said, well, if nobody wants to be served, then he will do something else. Ah. So I asked for the, oh, you know, it doesn't take me too long to ask for manager. I asked for the manager. And I said, you know, it's not that I even want my money now. I want to close my account. You know, I thought I had plenty of money in that account. No, it wasn't plenty. Of, but I said, I want to close my account in that bank. Aside from that, the power of the media, that I want to go now and tweet about it and talk about it the next morning on my show. Ah! Manager shouted. My pants is white, so no! And so he shouted on the guy, how can you say there's no change? It was at that point that young guy realized that, you know, this was more serious than I thought. But you know, it just brings it to the head. It has happened to us so many times. You go to eat in an eatery, it's about time for your change. They tell you no change. And you know what I don't like is that they don't tell you no change, you're like, oh, I'm so sorry. They don't even tell you until you notice. That for me, do you know that for me is robbery. Until I notice, ah, don't I have change? Oh, there's no change. You're a thief. 
if your heart was clear, you'd have just told me from the beginning, oh, you have 15 hours, but I don't have any, I don't have any change. Can you wait? Or, you know, let it be me to oh, take it away. No, I would have gone and said, I don't have to. No change. You are a thief, a rob, unarmed, but a robber nonetheless. Because when is my turn? When they tell you that maybe your change is 10 naira. So, okay, let me give you 20 naira. Give me 10 naira. They'll tell you, give me 10 naira. Let me give you 20 naira. Then you say, oh, I don't have... I don't have 10. You think they will just give you 20? For where? <laughs> they put it back and say, well, there's no change. It is a habit in this country. And you know, whether you like it or not, you might think I'm being harsh, but you are, you are, you are actually a thief. Because it's my money and you don't want to give it to me. Just that you're not holding a gun. And if you will say there is no change, give me an option. Can you, do, would you like this? Some people do that, though, even if you don't want the Tom Tom. But they will say, do you want Tom Tom, buttermeat or something? But some don't give you an option. And they get angry with you when they think like, uh, then they go, uh, Madam, it's not just 15 naira. They will look at you from head to toe and say, ah, I see to say, what is 15 naira? You know? That, 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 that for me makes that 15 naira more important because I'm thinking, you have no right to say so. I'm so glad a lot of people think like that. I'm sure people that will, will diss me now, people that have done it. But a lot of you agree with me and I'm happy because it's, it's, it's not right. And until we begin to stand our ground and say, if I will stand in front of you until you get my change, people will continue to do it. So, for all you know changers, look at me now. <laughs> if I get on your, on your line, you look for the changers. And you know, after I did that drama in, in, in that bank, he only finally brought the change to show him that the money made nothing to me. It was this, um, because when I was doing the drama now, the security <laughs> had come <laughs> to find out what's going on. So, to show him that that money made nothing to me, I just turned to the security man and said, my dear, have lunch, you know, just to show him. <laughs> That the money meant or the meant, but it meant nothing to me. I had to do that, but it's something that sometimes stand your ground and demand for your change, whether it's five, ten, fifteen, twenty, or hundred naira. Okay, let me know your experiences with the no change saga. Let me know your experience. Maybe it was it was that my own at the bank. It will never forget me. And vent out, vent out. It's allowed. It's allowed. <laughs> T O L. I'll catch you next time.